My family has supported me every day. They give me a lot of motivation and they uh, ensure that I take good breaks and they help me take those breaks by going out with me or playing sports with me. They have given me enough independence. They let me decide how much I want to study. They let me decide everything. They are just there if I want to ask them something. If I want their opinion on something, they're there to give it to me, but they don't force it upon me. So it's absolutely perfect. My name is Ayush Agarwal. I am currently in 12th grade, hoping to go to IIT. My father is a software engineer. He is the co-founder of Bluestacks. He's also from IIT Kanpur, electrical science. My mother is also an engineer, but she does not work anymore. She is currently housewife. I have a brother in eighth grade. I have always liked physics and maths and somewhat chemistry. So when in 11th grade, the time came to pick my subjects, I just took PCM and which led me to try to get JE and yeah, so I've always liked physics and maths. There has not been a particular time when I realized that I want to become an engineer. Mostly my father because he himself is an engineer and he realized that I like math and physics in the smaller grades like before fifth grade and he enlisted me for some classes and stuff and I really liked those classes. So that's where I got to know I like physics and maths and therefore engineering. So my basic strategy was to do theory very well for the first time. I once did it in class with the teachers and then uh, once at home from NCRT. NCRT is very important for JE Main. You should remember almost every line that a question can be framed from. Yeah, so theory from NCRT and then I did 100 or 200 questions uh, for every chapter as practice and that helped the concepts settle down in my mind. Yeah, that has been the preparation strategy for the whole of 11th and 12th. And then uh, just some days before the exam, I did the NCRT again, tried to memorize every important line. And uh, I revised theory from Sengage for physical chemistry, physics and mathematics. Sengage is a very good book. Well, just make sure you're having fun and you're not fully into JEE studying 10 hours a day. I would say you should study max eight hours a day, maybe even six and take appropriate breaks. That helps you still enjoy life. So you won't uh, really be distracted if you're still enjoying life. In the last month, I just, uh, well, I had a lot of syllabus left, chapters that I had never done before because I had wasted a lot of time in 11th grade. So uh, I made a spreadsheet uh, using the JE main syllabus document. I made a spreadsheet uh, with all the chapter names and beside every chapter name I put a rating on a scale of 1 to 5 uh, depending on how difficult that chapter is for me and how much time it would take for me to do that chapter properly and then I started with the easiest chapters so that I could finish up a lot of the work in the first week perhaps then I to revise theory I used uh, NCRT, Sengage and my class notes that's all I used to revise theory. I did not do too many PYQs as I did not have enough time, but most of you should aim to have enough time because doing PYQs is very important. I got lucky this time. And for inorganic and organic chemistry, Sengage is quite bad uh, in my opinion. So just use NCRT and your class notes. My family has supported me every day. They give me a lot of motivation and they uh, ensure that I take good breaks and they help me take those breaks by going out with me or playing sports with me and they've, like, they've always been a source of great motivation and they've never pushed me too hard they've given me enough independence they let me decide how much I want to study they let me decide everything they are just there if I want to ask them something if I want their opinion on something they're there to give it to me but they don't force it upon me so it's absolutely perfect <laughs> My teachers, uh, Ajay Tripathi sir for math, Ajay Devari sir for physics and Mahboob sir for chem have been very supportive throughout the two years I've been uh, in this journey. Uh, they've always answered my doubts. They've been uh, very good at teaching concepts in the class, which is what matters the most to me. And they've always been there to motivate us. They've stood by us in hard times. 
advice for GE aspirants would mainly to be start studying hard from the start of 11th. I made that mistake and it cost me a lot. I got lucky this time, so it didn't cost me as much as it would have in a normal scenario. Start studying hard from 11th and don't study too hard. Do not study more than eight hours a day. Take appropriate breaks. Do not forget to have fun in your life. Otherwise, you will feel like J is just a burden. I am very happy with my life currently just because of the small breaks I'm taking and the small amounts of fun I'm having with my family. That's all. And for study sources, Sengage is good for theory. Sengage Maths is good for questions as well. And CRT is very important, especially for J mains and even for advanced, it's quite important. Best of luck for J aspirants.